I'm John. I'm Edward. And together we are She Edward. Edward. And this is Let's Chat. I think my go-to is like reality TV, something that everyone's watching, knowing that everyone in their different households all sharing that same experience by tuning in. My favorite experience is one where it, uh, you, you invest time in the characters and the show progresses and gets bigger and bigger as the seasons go on. I think, what, what's it, what is it? Adventure, I like adventure. I like superheroes. I like Ireland AM. I love turning on the morning, styling my hair, having a shower, seeing what's happening in the world. Once a theme song plays, you know it's time to put on that kettle of tea. And like the presenters, they're always like taking up the notch, they're changing up their looks and growing beards and changing their hair. Yeah, yeah. making them feel even more relaxed than they already are. Uh, my TV guilty pleasure would have to be um, it's, um, watching all my TV appearances on television. We don't TV. watch a load no, of TV. We only watch stuff that we're on. My guilty pleasure would have to be looking at Love Island, like Jesus. Come I'm, on. I'm like, oh, Love Island, like it was addictive. Like, I watched Love Island to bond with my cousins who were girls and they seemed to be all about it, so I was all about it. And then I found myself actually watching it of my own free will. I would 100% go on Love Island to get those Instagram followers. I'd go on Love Island and they'd all want a piece of me. They'd all be like, can I get a taster, John? And I'd be like, sorry, I'm not in your couple. I'd bring in-depth conversation because it's very surface level. Yeah, I feel like I'd bring all the laughs and the, the I'd get them all doing things to express themselves and I, yeah, I'd love it. We have loads of TV ideas, but we're gonna have to have a meeting with Virgin Media because it's intellectual property of Jedward. 100%, you can't be just saying your ideas left, right and center. There's always people listening, looking for that next big idea. I'm pretty certain I came up with Gogglebox. I remember I was like, we need an interactive show where people are watching things. Boom, Gogglebox. Yeah, it's a pretty ABC123, but I feel like, you know, we're excited about the future. I feel like you've got to always, you know, see the bigger picture and just give people what they want. I would really, really like to do Gogglebox, us there sitting with all our dogs on the sofa. No, because I like just being in the moment. Like right now we're doing an interview and it's very, I know you like, we want these like everyday people, but like we are just everyday people. I know we're Jebber right now, but like we live a normal life most of the time. Yeah, I like wearing a robe. I like sitting there drinking a hot drink, get in the dark. The boys, the boys. Yeah, and we have animals, pets, we all have a great time. What's next is a new album, more TV shows. Fly over to LA, see if our place is all still in order. And then go on stage again. I can't wait to be on stage for two hours playing guitar. Yes, yeah, so we've had to reschedule our tour twice. So we'll be doing more tour dates so you can see us shaking our hips on stage. And we're gonna be running a lot. I love running, I've got back into running a lot. So we'll be probably on the Olympics for in 2020 or something. And the Biden 2022. Yeah, Love Island 100%. Get us in the Speedos. We wanna wear the love. I think we will do Eurovision at some point before 50, even host it. I feel like a lot of people for this generation, we are those guys that did Eurovision twice in history. Yeah, like we can all be serious and write the winning song and go out there and people just be like, wow. <laughs> for guys. It is crazy to think that we did do Eurovision in 2011, 2012. Like we could have easily done it for a third year. And like we will definitely always have Eurovision in our hearts. It'll always come up every single year. And I think every year people do think, where's Jared? <laughs> we'll come back like a reboot sequel of, you know when they bring back the different Back to the Future, or like Disney remakes the- I would love if Ireland made like an Ireland vision where every county has a representative and like forget the All-Ireland final and hurling, it would be about the talent in Ireland.